I have been hiding something from you and it's time for me to come clean. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. Heck. As you can see, the fall vibes are finally here. So I thought it was about time I went ahead and shared some of my favorite go-to products lately, especially since I've been a little MIA, if you will. But before we get into today's video, please make sure that you are subscribed and be sure to hit that notification bell boo so you don't miss when I upload another video. Duh. And of course, if you enjoyed today's video, I would greatly appreciate if you gave me a thumbs up because it really helps to support my channel. And of course, if you are interested in any single thing that I mentioned here today, please make sure that you shop via the links down below in the description box because that also really helps to support my channel. Thank you so much. I appreciate you. Now, before we dive into my favorites, I have to give another huge thanks to Nordstrom for sponsoring a portion of today's video. I have told you countless times on the channel how Nordstrom is one of my absolute favorite places to go to for anything beauty. I'm talking hair care, skin care, makeup, and fragrance. And y'all know I like to smell good. And oddly enough, every single beauty product that I have been loving on lately, you can easily grab online or in store at Nordstrom. Now, y'all already know that we love Nordstrom here, but let me go ahead and dive into these favorites i'm gonna start off with my scent of the day because i'm just too excited that i finally had this in my collection this is parfums de marley oriana i actually got this in the one ounce which is just too cute look how look how adorable <laughs> this bottle is so cute so like I said, this is my scent of the day. So I'm going to go ahead and refresh this on my skin. Tap. Don't rub. First of all, this bottle is just too cute. And I cannot wait to add this to my shelf with her other perfumes, the Marley Sisters. Now this here, Oriana, starts off really, really bright and fresh and citrusy. And as we dry down, we get into those white florals, which really makes it sophisticated and elegant and polished and refined. Mm, come on, run on sentence. And as it dries down, it just gets really sweet and creamy and fluffy. It's definitely really light and airy, not too, too sweet, not super juvenile, which there's a time and place for that, but this just reminds me of a more refined, slightly more upscale version of Mont Blanc Signature, which is another one of my favorite scents that I feature here previously on the channel. Just to give you a little bit of a comparison, definitely not the same, but in the same kind of fragrance family, at least to my nose. So good, okay? I have been loving this offline and kind of gatekeeping a little bit, but I'm sharing now. You know what I'm saying? It's it's fine. Oriana is just really pretty and super girly and I'm so happy to have it and highly recommend picking it up. Another scent that I've been obsessed with that I may or may not have been keeping to myself, also from Parfums de Marley, is cult classic the Lena Exclusive, which I have never featured on my channel, but just know that the love is real. As you can see from my lost tassel and <laughs> beat up bottle, I'm actually going to layer these because I deserve nice things. This is... I might have just did something with that combo, but let me stay focused. This is definitely top two and an eight number two. The Lena Exclusive. Indescribable, okay? It's everything that the girlies say that it is. It's the most beautiful and most complimented fragrance in my collection. I'm gonna just go ahead and put that out there. You absolutely have to be a Rose fan, but even if you're not a Rose fan, I still, I still highly urge you to give this a sniff. This is just the most beautiful, wealthy, effortless woman in a bottle scent. <laughs> The Lena Exclusive is just one of those scents that just makes me feel so beautiful and like I got all my stuff together, okay? This is definitely a more modern and honestly more mass appealing rose in my humble opinion. Also has some woodiness and some vanilla that makes it a bit more palatable than its big sister, the OG Delina. Delina Exclusive, 
is going to go down as one of my absolute favorite fragrances of all time. Not just of right now, but of all time. This is going to forever be in my collection and I highly recommend getting your nose on this one. Last but not least, because these niche fragrances can get really pricey and flare up some commitment issues, I have been loving this Creed Discovery set. Oh, so cute. Let me take this out of the box and show you what we got. As you can see, once my lighting gets itself together, thank you so much. This comes with five samples of some of Creed's most popular for women scents. Y'all know I wear what I want to wear when I want to wear it. Now this set comes with Aventus for Her, Aqua, Fiorentina, Love in Black, Love in White, and Spring Flower. I am still dating and getting to know Creed, but right now my favorite is absolutely Spring Flower, which is perfectly named because if this ain't spring in a bottle, I don't know what it is. Spring Flower is right up my alley. Super fresh and clean. Almost like a upscale shampoo. It's such a pretty boss energy scent. And don't even get me started on the projection and the performance, okay? Don't get me started. Now I get it. If you're not a floral person, you might hear the name Spring Flower and run in the opposite direction. But... Hear me out. This is a scent that I urge you to try on your skin because of the musk and ambergris in the base. You just have to experience it. In my opinion, Cree is a super intimidating and very expensive niche fragrance house. So I highly recommend getting your hands on a discovery set so that way you can see what is actually worth your coin. Okay, you're welcome. So those are a few of the fragrances that I have been loving and got really telling y'all about. <laughs> so let's go ahead and dive into makeup. Now you all know if you've been following me for some time that I don't really change my makeup much. I kind of stick to what I know works. That being said, in recent months, I have been circling back to classics that have always been reliable and dependable. And one of those is MAC blushes, okay? I needed it. This one is the MAC Sheer Tone Shimmer Blush. And this is in the shade Peach Twist. Of course, it's in the package upside down, embarrassing me. Peach Twist is a shade of MAC blush that I have been in love with for years. And I'm so, 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 so glad that I have re-added this back to my makeup lineup. Here is how it looks in the pan. This gives the most beautiful but subtly radiant flush to my skin and if you've been around, you know how I feel about black girls and blush, like obsessed. One thing about it, MAC is going to give you a blush, honey. This is the most perfect, peachy, subtly radiant blush. And I just, I know I keep turning my head, but that's because I really want you all to see how beautiful this is on my skin. Like, I'm not wearing any highlighter. There's no highlighter. It's just the blush giving me this radiance and helping me irradiate my black girl magic okay like love this highly recommend getting your hands on it this next makeup product is fairly new to my collection but i have been reaching for it non-stop since i picked it up and this is the charlotte tilbury lip cheat which looks like this and i have mine in the shade foxy brown i mentioned this to you all in my most recent beauty haul and i also mentioned this to you all in my most recent get ready with me which i'll have both of those linked up in the cards this has become my go-to lip pencil i did use this to line my lips today this is just the most smooth almost velvety lip pencil that i have had ever this lip pencil is another cult classic that is always raved about in the beauty community and so i had to see what was up as black girls you know what i'm saying we always need a brown lip liner charlie really did her big one with this lip pencil it applies so easily and blends so smoothly and 10 out of 10 would highly recommend last but not least for makeup another product that i have been loving on and raving to you all about for probably a year or so at this point is this dior attic lip glow oil which looks like this in the packaging. So cute. It's metallic, so it's probably not going to really register well on camera, but I digress. I am wearing this today. This is the Lip Glow Oil in Cherry, and I have featured, I featured this on the channel so many times. I am wearing this today, but because I've been talking so long, it is time for me to go ahead and reapply it. And do you see? 
don't play with her okay look at look this <laughs> there's a reason that i have talked to you all about this non-stop for like a year at this point this is definitely one of my most favorite unnecessary bougie products i absolutely love the way this dior lip oil makes my lips look and feel and like look at the material like this looks these even after my lips are no longer super glossy my lips are still soft and moisturized as they should respectfully but this has been a favorite for a reason and it's going to continue to be a favorite highly highly recommend picking this one up as well so those are all of the makeup products that i've been obsessed with lately let's go ahead and dive into hair care so first up from my hair favorites is this olaplex number no. four bond maintenance shampoo which i have most definitely featured on the channel previously i could tell you a little secret i've actually been storing this upside down so that way i can get every single drop okay i have been loving this shampoo now i can't say this is going to be everyone's experience but every single time i use this my hair feels really soft but also feels really fortified we turn this back upside down for the sake of the video we all know that olaplex has this patented bond technology that just really helps to replenish the hair and that has absolutely been my experience this shampoo is not only refortifying and strengthening my hair but it's also somehow moisturizing and gives me slip and the lather goes crazy which is why this mini has lasted me so long because I don't need a lot in order for me to get my hair thoroughly cleansed and 10 out of 10 but highly recommend i don't i don't know what else to say another hair product i've been obsessed with also from olaplex is the olaplex number no. nine bond protector nourishing hair serum and shout out to my sis sheree for putting me on to this 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 is unlike any serum that I have ever tried. One, because it has that Olaplex patented bond technology. But two, this serum has a different consistency from any other serum that I've ever tried in my hair. It's almost like a lightweight gel. So when I use this on my natural hair, it gives a bit of hold to whatever set style I'm doing. Now when I use this on my blown out on my straight hair, it not only gives me heat protection and adds shine and luster to my hair, it also helps to refortify the hair with that patented Olaplex technology that we all maybe not all but that a number of us know and love this is another nearly empty olaplex product that i had to tell you all about because i have been obsessed and once it's gone just know i'm going to be buying another one and i highly recommend you do the same and last but not least for hair also from olaplex is their number seven bonding oil which I have most definitely featured on the channel. And as you can see, this is nearly empty as well. I know y'all are currently on the no oils, no butters train, and that's good for y'all. But as for me and mine, I'm going to continue using oil. And one of my favorites lately has been this number seven bonding oil from Olaplex. Not only does it help to smooth and add shine to my hair, it also really softens my hair as well. I actually used it today to add a little bit of luster and some finishing touches to my little flat twist protective style today it don't matter if my hair is curly or straight because while this smooths and adds shine to my hair it does so without weighing it down it's super concentrated so a little bit actually does go a long way in this instance now keep in mind that i'm saying a little bit goes a long way with my bottle being nearly empty so a buy a pig it absolutely worth the investment and i will definitely be repurchasing so those are my current hair care obsessions let's go ahead and dive into a little bit of body care first up is this necessaire deodorant gel which i have most definitely featured on the channel previously this as you can see is in the eucalyptus scent and you can also see that it is nearly empty i have been loving this not only does this deodorant gel keep me dry and keep me from smelling funky this also contains aha ingredients which can really help with darkness and hyperpigmentation now because of the exfoliating properties i tend to wear this at night but i have worn this outside during the day during hot months and it has worked for me now that's not me saying that this will work for everybody but what i am saying is that it works for me absolutely love this and last but not least for body care is this kosa sport 
AHA serum deodorant, another deodorant that I have featured on the channel previously. My lights are too bright, so I'll go ahead and insert a photograph. This is another deodorant that I tend to wear at night because of its chemical exfoliation properties, but I've also worn it during the day, outside, during warmer months, and it does a great job at keeping me dry, keeping me from smelling funky, and this also has that chemical exfoliation benefit as well. Now, of course, you can't see it because the packaging is opaque, but this is also nearly empty because I'm obsessed love it and have been using it so much definitely recommend getting your hands on it especially if you are someone who experiences darkness and hyperpigmentation in your underarm area so folks that about wraps up today's favorites video let me know if you also love any of the products that i mentioned here today if you are interested in anything that i mentioned here today make sure that you shop via the links down below in the description box and special thanks again to nordstrom for sponsoring a portion of today's video be sure to drop down in the comments and let me know your thoughts and on your way to watching another video of mine make sure you like share and subscribe. Thank you all so, 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 so much for watching. Please, please, please be safe and I'll catch you in the next one.